Hey guys, uh, Captain Alex Mason here, and I finally did, I got the PlayStation 3 and Black Ops 2. Um, I was hoping, to be honest, um, to see the intro video, but I guess it didn't work. Anyway, I'm going to create a new story. Oh shoot, I forgot the options again. I keep forgetting to put the subtitles. But it might be on. I'll also be explaining some of the characters. That's uh, Commander Harp Mike Harper. And the other guy is uh, Commander David Mason. Ooh, what kind of stuff's hiding inside that building? Just cover every inch of the vault, sir. I also got a free DLC playing this. I got getting this game. It's Woods! Sergeant Frank Woods. Sergeant Woods. Raul Menendez is the leader of Cortes Dia. And the most dangerous terrorist since Osama bin Laden. That's Raul Menendez. I forget what his rank is. Yeah, you back off. I'm going to try and do a altern do all the alternate endings. Flashbacks. Boys better get your shit together. Uh, he has Menendez on his one on his board. Why? If you have information about a threat to national security, you gotta tell us. Yeah, tell the Navy SEALs, man. They're SEALs, um, also they're with the JSOC. Yes, it's all Hudson's fault. So that's Alex Mason, my favorite character. Hey. An unknown Chinook enters the Alaskan airspace. Ooh. He wasn't in the army, he was in the Marines. Get it right. Alright, so that guy in the suit is all of General... No, Lieutenant Colonel Oliver L. North. And he's a real person. And then that's Jason Hudson, but... Yeah. I just don't like his voice for this game. So go get it, CIA. Why are you here? Castro and the Russians are all over Angola. We can't go in. Cursed Castro. CIA who buried the mission. Woods and his squad no longer exist. They got whatever you need, mate. Name it. Yeah, name it. David can stay with Jenny. Like before. She loves having him. He'll be fine. Marines. Wait, how's he his uncle? That's weird. Okay. Alright, so one thing that's different about this is that uh, you can customize your own stuff. Which I find interesting. But you know what, I'm going to stick with what I have. And... I'm going to start the mission.
30,000 feet. This was not the digital age. This film had to be processed, analyzed, and delivered all by hand. Our dog in the fight, a guy named Jonas Davimbi. You think I'm fucking nuts? Ah, oh, that looks like it hurts. Is he? I think that's an African American guy. No, I gotta save him. Okay, that's um, Commandant or Lieutenant. I think it's Lieutenant Colonel. I don't know. I know he's an officer, Jonas Savimbi, and he died in 2002. Um, this this is the Angolan Civil War, and this has been going on since 1986, which is the year we're in now. And it ended in 2002 when they killed him. Okay, so he's a four-star general, I guess. Okay, so we have machete as a melee weapon. That's Hudson. <laughs> he's got bodies. I love this music, but it sounds more Spanish. I'm not being racist about it. I'm just saying it's... I don't know if it fits in with this kind of, uh... Uh... Location, but hey. They can try. Otherwise, it's a good game. What? What? Oh yeah, that's right. This game has shivs. Or torsos. I did try zombies out a bit, and I'm doing terrible, but only because I haven't played it my own time. Seriously, who is hitting me? Ah, um, I'm, I'm, my aim's terrible. Alright, so the first piece of intel I saw was over here. This is what I like, you can actually access stuff. So I got two mortar shells. Throw it! And it worked. I noticed. Ow. What? Okay, I'm not gonna mess around this time. We don't mess around. Who's hitting me? I'm terrible. Whoa! What? Wait, why am I moving? Oh, that's why. Well, at least they didn't run me over. What? Oh my god. You know, I'm about ready to steal that person's RPG.
Oh, I missed it. Wait, what happened to your grenade launcher thingy? Never mind. Another thing I like about this game is now I about this console is now that I can get achievements. Which will be fun because then I'll like push myself to the limit. I'm kind of getting used to this. I've had a little practice playing the Xbox, but no, yeah, I think PS3 is better. But that's all my pu public opinion. I did want to get um, Xbox because of uh, my British pal, because I haven't seen him in a while. But then a lot of my um, friends from playing online in the Wii said, "Well, you should get PS3." They're all playing it, so I have. Uh, I haven't really gotten the PlayStation Network to work yet, because apparently I need, like, some sort of, uh, uh, master account to, like, overlook us. Okay, so they were the good guys, but they lost. That was the sad part. And I am filming in a different place. I'm recording in the, my up second floor of my house. Last time you saw me recording stuff, it was in my basement. I still couldn't believe when this came out. I actually was excited to see that they were both alive. And then I was like, "What?" The next fucking place. Made the Hilton look good. Lost seventeen of my group. Everybody says me too. It was just me. I was not gonna die in a fucking swamp. And then he most certainly didn't. Um. There's a game called Black Ops The Classified available for the PlayStation Vita. Um, that explains some of the gaps in between this storyline. Alright, I actually had difficult with this mission. Alright, I'm going to first try out trade by getting the good ending. Whoa! No, no! Oh, I'm going to have to end it here. I'll see you guys later.